What's going on everybody? Oxidize are bringing you another corrupted dungeon and your sword lord, me, myself, the testosterone daddy. We are, uh, we're changing things. We're changing things up. We're making some moves. We are today. Today we are a bow ho. No offense to all the bow users out there, but there are, there, there's a couple of bow builds I'm going to try within the next uh, week or so that you're going to see here on the channel. Today, we're going to do a bow of bad on build. By the way, link in the description below to a website called Albion Stats. And it, and you can see some of the top builds by the top players. Um, I will, I'm not even going to lie to you. I'm going to, I'm going to be using this website and kind of trying a lot of these builds that I see here on this website just to show you some fun stuff and uh, see how I do with them, really. So today, we're using the bow of bad on. Um, by the way, I have no prior knowledge on how some of these builds work, so uh, I'm only I'm only using my best uh, intuition on how we're gonna on how we're gonna go about this. Mind you, I am getting my graduate degree in chemistry, so I'm a little bit smarter than the average bear. However, not really a bow guy, so this should be a lot of fun. So this should be a lot of fun. So this should be a lot of fun. Uh, we're gonna go with deadly shot, uh, ray of light. Well, we'll probably go. Um, explosive arrows and then when we go to pvp we will go into ray of light from there uh raging storm so raging storm so 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 here's the combo right pvp wise you keep this on just deal damage from a distance nice and easy uh this one ray of light deals damage to enemy roots them then you hit them with the raging storm it creates a cloud that lasts five seconds within a radius they deal it deals uh 68 magic damage every 0.3 seconds and when they leave the area of the uh lighting lightning they get hit an additional seven times Okay, so not bad, not too shabby at all. So it kind of goes together. You root them down, you hit them with this, and then they take a lot of damage. On top of that, we're going to go the piercing arrows. Um, uh, the piercing arrows passive because it gives, it gives you extra damage. This gives it extra slow. So maybe you could think about this, but that 10%, it matters, but not really enough for me. You know, I mean, 10% goes a long way. To, am I right, fellas? Tell me about it. Um, going to the cleric, how we're gonna go ice block and the extra damage. It's gonna be really good for a lot of like, you know, against like 1v1 builds, so on and so forth. Uh, the mercenary jacket goes really, really well with the bow of bat on because of all the, um, the, the damage over time effects that it has with the E. Gives you a lot of damage for bloodlust. The assassin shoes with the, uh, balanced mind and the refreshing sprint. And we're gonna go poison potions and stews on this one. And there's my IEP sitting at 961. We are in stalker. And boys, let me tell you, I have the highest infamy I've ever had, 63k. Now, the the goal is to keep it at 63k or higher. That means we cannot afford to lose here. Um, something that you may or may not know about me when it comes to using things like bows, um, I'm not a dad. So when it comes to anything kite related, uh, I'm not very good at it. Uh, I am getting better though. I would say overall, I'm getting better at kiting, but it is it is a uh, it is something that I, I struggle with on a daily basis. Um, much like my ego, I uh, I am getting better. That's also why I, I when when I when I started to pick on the weapon that I was gonna go with. You know to, to, to be my main weapon that's why i went with swords you know they swords are a very in your face kind of weapon a lot of burst damage a lot of utility and just trying to you know get after it basically that's why i i uh, I, I gravitated towards them i'm more i'm definitely more of a berserker i'm not really a uh a very e elusive type you know what i mean <laughs> um i had a had a it was it was leg day today believe it or not very good leg day well here's the thing actually so obviously uh they, they, you know with 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 everything in the world right now and still things are not really quarantined but i have to you know i gotta be careful because the gf old shelby she works on uh, in in, uh, in healthcare with old people so i'm not able to, to really leave I can't go to the gym to like a shared space basically. So I am slowly building my home gym. And I think tomorrow, which would be when this video comes out. So today I am getting a, uh, a squat rack for, for the old home gym, which is located right there, <laughs> right to the left of me. All uh, th th this, it, it, it's really impressive that this little apartment we have, this, this particular room is a lot of things. It's my stream studio. It's my, 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 uh, my girlfriend's makeup little area. And then also my home gym. And let me tell you, dude, it works. It, it works really well. Big update on it though. We got rid of the, uh, we got rid of the, um, 
the litter boxes. The litter boxes are outside now, so it doesn't smell like a, like 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 cat shit in here 24/7 anymore. So that's that's actually super awesome. That's probably the best upgrade to the home gym I'm ever gonna get. Let me tell you. All right. So how how are things looking right now? Can I be honest with you? Can, like like, like if, if I'm ever honest with you, let, let it be right now. Look at the clear speed on this bad boy. Dude, that's faster than uh, the Duke brothers going over a, a 45 degree angle ramp. That's not bad, dude. We're, uh, it's actually doing, doing some pretty decent damage here. I'm impressed. Tickle me impressed. We'll say that much. I will say, the more, the more and more I play Corrupted Dungeons, which is like pretty much the only thing I do in Albion uh, these days, just because it's, it's honestly the most fun I've had in this game since I played it. Just because there's, I don't know, there's stakes. There's money to, to be gotten. There's, uh, you know, trying to be the very best that no one ever was. It's all a part of Corrupted Dungeons, and it's it's so it's so much fun to do. Um, but the uh, the final boss, if, if if you if you if your build is not set for the final boss, it can be a little bit of a doozy. Let me tell you, I'm I'm actually impressed about how difficult they uh, they, they make. Cause I, when when I first got into Corrupted Dungeons, I kind of thought it would have been kind of like a. Uh, sort of a what's the word how, how should i put this i thought the pv portion might have been a little bit of a snooze fest but when i you know when i was going through the beta i was uh, pleasantly surprised to see that it actually took a little bit of testosterone something that i am uh, you know i have plenty of thank you to the, to, the, to the vast and great genetics of my mother and father uh to, to, to beat some of the at least the final boss the, the, these these guys right here really aren't too bad honestly these ones are not too bad at all. So let's see if we can get here. I will say though, the loot's getting kind of crazy. 63k. I mean, I can only imagine the 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 rusties, the flaccids, the uh, the the, the e-carts, the the people who are actually the humper dinks. Big shout out to all those people. The the ones who are actually good at this kind of stuff. How much money they're making when um from from like you know one mil plus infamy. Insane, insane. Ooh, okay. All right, all right. So this this goes to this. I think that's the only thing we need to change as well. I don't know. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. Well, Oxy, if you lose, you know it's a it's pre-recorded. You don't have to show it. Yes, I do. <laughs> oh, you know I have to show it. I, you you got to show them all. Uh, what am I worried about? I don't. I honestly don't know. Other ranged pe people who are who are good at ranged. Honestly, might be my, my biggest concern here. Um, Claymore. I mean, I don't know, man. Claymore. I mean, that's why we have the uh, cleric house because of Claymore. Not because it's not only Claymore, but one of the reasons. Claymore is do a lot of damage to you. So I saw him. I saw him over here hitting it. Oh, also, we brought poison potions rather than healing potions because we have so much healing with mercenary jacket. That's the idea. There he is. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, he, he just lost all of his heroic sex. That's really good. Yep, Claymore. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Yes. So we have to watch out. Luckily, the E has a cast time to it. Well, we're not, we're not going to walk into that trap. Remember when I said I'm smarter than the average bear? I.E. I'm smarter than the average bear. Thank you very much. Is he, is he just trying to run away now? Like, is he just going to rat away? No. There we go. Oh, damn. So, I mean, that, that's pretty hard to hit. There we go. I don't see any reason to, to, to waste the refreshing sprint. Okay, that was pretty good. That, I, I, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. Okay. I honestly think we'll win this. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Uh, you, you, you probably... I mean, honestly, it probably doesn't matter. Right. Okay, cool. Oh, I thought we had his ass. <laughs> Come on. Where are you going, dude? I'm going to be mad. Honestly, this is working out in my favor because my, my cleric cow... I mean, you don't risk that, right? You just, you just you just let him do his thing. All 
I mean, that works out. There we go. Now, 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 now we get him on the poison. Now we hit him with a little bit of that. Yeah, baby. Now we're talking. Now we're doing a little bit of damage to him. I shouldn't have used my refreshing sprint. That one's on me. But it did get our cooldowns back a little bit quicker. So, okay, okay, okay. So there's a little bit of a mess up there, but it, it's, it's working. <laughs> That's the important part. So I am going to use my refreshing sprint to catch up to him. Oh, no! You coward! No, 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 no. We don't let him get away, though. We don't let him get away. Okay, good. See, is that run or refreshing sprint? That's definitely run. Hmm. He's like, he's like full blown just getting out of here. Okay, no, that's fine. Mm. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. Come on. What a coward. I, I never run away from my fights. I lose them like men. Like an absolute man. up on this one I, I i messed up i messed up i popped my no dude i popped <laughs> oh talking so much mess talk shit get hit brother oh okay so no one is more disappointed about that loss more than i am okay i'm gonna be real with you i talked a lot of mess there i my confidence was way up there um but honestly it was false confidence i was like why am i doing so well right now lo and behold <laughs> i should have known brother i should have known but i mean at least at least at least i know i can do it as, as long as i'm not bad at this game so the reason i popped my cleric cow so early was because i saw the three stacks he was going ham and like he honestly it was like a self bait i was like i got i got in my own head about it <laughs> I'm being real with you. So we want to try to meet him a little bit earlier. Oh, uh, mm, interesting. Okay. All right. All right. So far, so good. Uh, that was that wasn't very good. Okay, uh, now we run. This one's gonna hurt a little bit. Yeah, that one did, in fact, hurt a little bit. Oh no, come on. Go, 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 go. Run. Yeah, so, I, I, I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. And I wanna say this first, okay? I said before we started, I think I'm going to struggle with a few builds, Claymore and Ranged. And you're like, Oxy, that's all of them, brother. Short range, long range. You got to be able to beat one of them. So like, that's what I'm saying, dude. Any other short range, I got it. <laughs> Claymore, though. I mean, honestly, I almost had that Claymore. So, okay, so go ahead and get this ready. See what we're going up against here. Um, interesting. Time to put my money where my mouth is, huh? Okay, uh, Stew's been eaten. Pop him a little bit of that action. A little bit of this action. A little bit of that action. There we go. Good start. Okay, so now, so now, now, now we just kind of wait this out just a little bit. 
Okay. All right. Well, that's not good. Okay. Well, okay. Look, 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 look. It's garbage. The bow bat on is actually just a garbage weapon with uh, with garbage potential, and I don't really recommend it to anybody. But hey, if you want to give it a shot, go nuts, man. I don't know. I mean, it's it's on here. Check out AlbionStats.com. That's pretty good. Anyway, hey guys, like the video. Go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll be back next time with um, probably Warbow. I'm gonna give I'm gonna give Warbow a fair share. By the way, check this out. You've been killed by. God knows what, man. Who the hell knows? Anyway, guys, I'm out of here and see y'all later.